I2C or II is a flexible communication protocol, which allows certain modules from manufacturers like Whimsical Wraps and Monom to send commands to each other digitally, which opens up possibilities that 3.5mm patch cables can't facilitate. This digital network is described as a bus, and setting up an I2C bus is pretty straightforward. It requires the connection of three matching headers across each module using jumper wires. And the wires most commonly used are linked in the video's description. To reduce the risk of dropped data, just be sure to get ones that are around 6 to 8 inches in length. Most modules have two vertical columns of pins, but we only need to use one column per connection. This allows us to daisy chain one module to the next. We always want to connect the pins in vertical order from the ground pin, which is often marked with a white line on the circuit board. Two modules may have the same orientation, like crow and width, where ground is the topmost pin, but some modules may go bottom up. Either way, to ensure successful connection, we'll pay close attention to connecting in order from ground. So we'll go ground to ground, middle pin to middle pin, and the last remaining pin to the last remaining pin. And that's it. Be sure to check this video's description for additional written documentation and a buy link for jumper wires. Thank you.